That's exactly the thought process. And I first learned that when Pete Carroll was at USC. I read an article that they don't recruit a guy to redshirt him. There's too many good players out there that want to come to this top five type school that we consider obviously Ohio State the top five. We're recruiting a player to play immediately. And now you have some great storylines in there. Why did you take Darren Lee then? Why did you take uh, uh, you know, maybe Josh Perry or Tyvis Powell? Why did you take uh, Malik Henderson? You know, those are the guys that maybe we just see this incredible uh, end of a career. So usually you only take a handful, you know, not even a handful, uh, three or four guys like that that are, you call them projects. But if it develops now, watch out, you have a monster. But we don't, we're not in the game. Years ago, you would do that. You'd say, let's take this kid, and what do you think he's going to be like in two to three years? We're very rarely into that. But, but, I, but, you, know. but you only played four true freshmen, I think, last year. Are you pushing it to the point this year? Very hard. Even if, if there's a kid that's maybe, put him in. Even if you're first a couple plays here, a couple plays there, we're going to play him. That happened Saturday. Keandre Jones, Malik, um, Coop. Some guys went in that game. Well, once again, are they going to be here five years from now? Probably not. And if they are, they probably got bypassed. And we're made, but maybe last year, maybe there would have been a year where no, you would have so, held off on Keandre or I don't know. Well, just last year, we had so many guys. Yeah. 